Good morning, good morning. Let's talk about some basic stock investing. And we're going to talk about exchange traded funds and go over some strong performing um, funds for 2024 going to 2025. So first, let's look at the SPY. So this is the um, S&P 500 ETF. It's currently up 1% on the day and um it's trading at 563 so let's look at a vanguard fund which is a total market etf which is going to be ticker vti so um this is it's going to be comprised of small, mid, and large cap stocks. So it's going to be um, a great choice for investors that's looking to get broad exposure. And this ETF is trading at $277. It was down um, 4% um, yesterday. So and this one has a 0 0.03, a 3% expense ratio. So let's go into technology and growth, and we're going to go look at the Qs, QQQ. And this is going to be top tech companies like Apple, Microsoft, Amazon. So this is going to be a popular ETF if you want to get diversification when it comes to growth and technology. And the Qs are currently trading at 473 49 and then let's dive deep and we're going international so we're going to do the iShares MSCI emerging market and the ticker symbol is going to be EEM all right so this one is going to give you exposure to large and mid-sized companies and emerging markets such as China india brazil right so this is going to be diversification if you're looking for the faster growth regions around the world and let's um for those who are looking to reduce the risk we're going to go to the vanguard etf um the developed markets so the ticker symbol is going to be v e a So this one is going to get um, exposure to markets outside of the U.S. It's going to be Europe, Japan, and Canada. So this is the strong way to diversifying stocks away from the U.S. market. So this one is currently trading at 51.75. So let's, we'll dive in to talk about a little bit and i'm on the tasty trade network we're gonna go with a a brief blog on um why to invest in etfs and then also this video is brought to you by theta decoded we have the free stock basic um, membership where it's going to be videos on investing in stocks and the basics of investing in the stock market and then we also have the um, option trading course if you're looking to generate passive income um, to your portfolio month in a month out and that course is $23.99 and just one second here while my screen loads up Okay, so let's let's dive into all things ETF. So ETFs, I believe, is a smarter choice than mutual funds because just because the expense ratio for the fees are um, going to be less. So when it comes to ETF, you're going to have countless options. So it's an investment vehicle that's going to gain significantly significant popularity over um, the last, let's say, 20 years. So let's go down to the first main point of why investing in ETF is gonna be diversification at a low cost. 
ETF provides instant diversification because it holds a collection of assets such as stocks, bonds, other than just one stock. For example, if you just were to invest in, let's say, NVIDIA, then you're subject to that company's risk, management risk, and it you know, not meeting its earnings and then necessarily going down. So you get to diversify your risk throughout multiple companies. So typically, uh, when it comes, ETFs are going to come with low expense ratios compared to mutual funds, making them, it's going to be a cost-effective way to diversify your investments. So like, again, the Vanguard Total Stock Fund, ticker symbol V. IT, for example, has an expense ratio of 3%, which means that you're only paying an annual of $3 every $10,000 you invest. So when it comes to ETF, the second main point is going to be liquidity and flexibility. You can get out of the trade very quickly. So unlike mutual funds, which only trade at the end of the day, ETFs trade on exchanges just like stocks. So this means that you can buy and sell them throughout the trading day at market prices. So the liquidity of ETF offers often makes them a flexible choice for both active and passive investors. So I wouldn't recommend this for those day traders, but if you're looking to like buy and hold and um, get some return on some of your invested assets, this will be a good choice for you. So you're going to also have a broad range of options when it comes to, you know, the U.S. stock market, international market, um, bond market, commodities, and then you can invest based off sectors, whether that's healthcare, technology, and whatnot. So, you know, for example, again, you have your SPY was going to be exposure to the U.S. market. You're going to have the QQQs, which is going to be the technology sector. You have the developed market, which is the VEA, the Vanguard Developed Market ETF. So um, this is going to allow you to tailor your portfolio based off your goals and your risk tolerance. And then also when it comes to taxes, right? ETFs are tax efficient. Um, more than mutual funds because of the unique structure, ETF managers don't have to sell assets or meet redemptions as mutual funds managers do, which can trigger taxable events. In many cases, investors only incur capital gain taxes when they sell their shares, making ETFs a more tax friendly option if you're looking to get long term capital gain tax and you're not trying to incur any short term capital gain part tax on this part of your um, portfolio so then also we have transparency etfs offer a high level of transparency most etfs publish their holdings daily so you always know what assets you're invested in this transparency is especially important for investors who want to keep a close eye on their portfolio and then obviously the name of the game is long-term growth potential so for example this is an easy way to track the S&P 500 with the SPI. So it's designed for long-term growth. Historically, the S&P 500, 500 has returned an average um, return of 10% annually. So it's going to you know, make your life simple and to save time when investing in ETFs. So also, ETFs are the smart choice for all types of investors. Whether you're a seasoned investor or you're just starting out, ETFs are going to offer several advantages. Um, they provide instant diversification, cost effectiveness, and they offer flexibility in trading. Additionally, the broad range of options and tax efficiency makes them a powerful tool for building a long-term investment portfolio. So, you know, once you have two or three ETFs, you know, you have a great portfolio and you're into the portfolio management. And it's a great way to segue from a beginner investor to get real intermediate real fast and really sophisticated with your long term growth investment strategies. So then again, this, thank you for guys for listening to the end. This video is brought to you by Theta Decoded. Um, it's ThetaDecoded.com. And um, to enroll in the free stock investing course, you just have to provide an email. And if you're looking to learn all things options to generate monthly income, we have a simple course that's easy to understand that is um, for 
it's you can trade it on any brokerage account, but we I film and I trade on Tastyworks, which they have dollar commissions and zero dollars to close. So it's all about you know saving you guys money and conditioning the lunch, the the time frames to learning and making sure that you guys are outpacing inflation which is very important so thetadecoded.com we have the option course for $23.99 and then with your email you guys can um enroll into the free stock um investing course and then also if you guys do that i'll give you guys a copy of the option trading profit edge um ebook um for free and then we'll have plenty of emails and then we'll let all free members you know ask email questions and stuff like that and then for those who want to invest in options for another diversification and to really maximize your returns to trade like a hedge fund manager you guys can do that as well all right thank you again trade smart